Hello dear students, we move forward in paper 2, CC 102, yes, British poetry from 14th century to 17th century, unit 4, acquaintance or we can say the short notes of the British poets who belong to 40th century up to the 7th century time period. Here friends, now we move forward, we will discuss about in the last video about the Samuel Butler. Now today we discuss about the new poets and that new poets is Robert Harrick. Robert Harrick. Robert Sonakahe. And this is the dialogues in the movies here, but we have to Robo. Robert, that you are remember that Robo movies of the Rajnikans, but it was not right with the correlation to remember the name to you that. But this is the poet who belonged to the up to the you can say that 16th or 17th century, and that poet is. Robert Herrick H E double R I C K Herrick and the last one of Robert Herrick he was born in 24th 24th August 1591 in London he was born in 24th August 1591 in London in Britain was United Kingdom and he was died in 15th October 15th October 1674 he was died in 15th October 1674 I think that was a big life fun around 83 years 83 years he was he lived a very long life of 83 years. We have to try to conclude that. This was the 9 and we have to add in 74. It becomes 83 years. Robert Herrick belonged to the 17th century. You will find out that that we have 15, 91. We add the 9 years. It completed 1600 and 1601. To 1700, it is known as a 17th century. Even today we can call that to 2020, but it is called the 21st century. In the same way, Robert Harry belonged to, or he belongs. There was a use the dear friends subject. Then in the past tense, you use the belonged ed, and that if you use in the simple present tense, you can say that. Robert Harry belongs to the 17th century and the past tense we can use Robert Harry belonged to yes 17th century speciality of Robert Harry he was lyric poet use the word lyric poet cleric he was used the time words. He was just a chandras kiyeh chiyeh. He type the kavitra a cleric and metaphysical poet. That in unit one metaphysical poet. Adi bhoti kavitra. Metaphysical poet. Here you can use in unit one. You study this topic metaphysical. Poetry, and then we discuss about what is the meaning of meta metaphysical poetry in the sense wherever I discuss about the syllabus, dear friends. That time I discuss about it. What is the meaning of meta? Meta means adi, and physical means bhautik. Adi bhautik means a spiritual kind of poetry. Those are our religious songs. Those are religious bhajans, haimans, stuti. They have to not directly say about the man. It is called the metaphysical poetry. Vijidi na chamkare, mutira paro panbai, 
it, it is the this line it, in the sense motira for vidya the life is very short and you have to use that life and you have to pray the god mara rame ramta rakhare rakhna ramakra this is the body we cannot control even that man was a wealthy paisa dar vyakti pan hoy mutti hoy che roki shake che and that this beautiful body was converted into the we can say ashes a s h s a s h e rak and these are the directly that was a it was directly addressed to the something some object but inwardly there was a different meaning સીધી રીતે એ બીજા વસ્તુની ઉદબોધીને કહેવામાં આવે એનું ઉદબોધન ઓબ્જેક્ટ હોય એને બીજી જગ્યાએ મારા રામે રમતા રાખ્યા રહ્યા રાખના રમકડા રમકડા રાખ પણ એ કોને શરીર ઉદબોધન કરવા આ શરીર છે નાશવંત છે નાશ્વર છે આજે એનો નાશ થવાનો છે એની મોહમાં છોડો અને મારા રામનું નામ ભજો ઇન ધ સેમ વે ઇઝ આ ધ ગુજરાતી બીકોઝ યુ કેન ઇઝીલી અન્ડરસ્ટેન્ડ દેટ વાય આઈ હેવ ટુ ગીવ ધ વન એક્ઝામ્પલ ઓફ ધ વોટ ઇઝ ધ I give the example of metaphysical poetry. In the same way, in English, there was a one general and the poet John Donne is a founder of, remember that dear friend, I asked the question, who is the founder of metaphysical poetry? So, meta, John Donne is founder or called the John Donne. I have to write John Donne. you are john dun is called the father or founder f o u n d e r of metaphysical poetry and here in the english they use this kind of the concept concept and in this use the witty they can wrote the poetry and this kind of spiritual poetry and this kind of the train there are the group of the poet and they are known as the metaphysical poet and this in this group robert hell is one of the metaphysical poet eric is the metaphysical poet and this metaphysical title was given by dr samuel johnson for this group of the poet and those are the in your syllabus in your syllabus there are group of the list of the poet we discuss about them those are henry wall and to marvels one these are the poet robert harry john Dunn. these are the poet they are known as a metaphysical poet okay this okay now it is robert harry lifespan he was born in 24th august 1591 in london in united kingdom he was died in 15 24 August and he died in 15th October 1674 in London. He was lived a, a long life of 83 years. He belonged to the or he belongs to the age that is was 17th century. Speciality of Harry Robert Harry he was very quiet. Clearly and metaphysical poet lyric poet you know the film song those are the song they are the lyrical lyric એટલે urmi kavita jema lagni no upro hoy there were not fixed in particular pattern sonnet required 14 lines ode that was 50 to 200 lines epic is was written in the 12 books there are we can say about the aa kavena સ્વરૂપ તમને કહીએ છીએ તો સોનેટ હોય તો કેવું તો મિત્રો હોય ચૌદ લાઈનમાં લખવામાં આવે બીજાને કરા કરી આ ખાલી વાત કરું છું ઉપર ચાલી આઈ બી પેન્ટા મિટર પણ ચૌદ લાઈનમાં ઓડ લખો તો પચાસથી બસો લાઈન છે એંસીથી બસો લાઈનને અંદર સુધી લખી શકો તમે એલઈઝી લખો તો એ કરુણ પોષસથી કોઈના મૃત્યુ પણ લખવામાં આવતી હોય એપિક લખો તો એ બાર પુસ્તકોમાં લખાયેલું હોવું જોઈએ એન્ડ ધેટ્સ વાય દે હેઝ અ પર્ટિક્યુલર ફોર્મ બટ લિરિક as no it was written in the 2 3 lines it is in the 12 line 15 line 20 line but it address the im- human emotion just like in the movies the song of filmy song they have addressed the songs a romantic song ha eh? film na romantic song ma apne jota hoye chhe the hero ni heroine patti no prem atho ko friend ma to no lagni 
ભાવ જે વ્યક્ત કરે હોય તેને શું કહેવાય લિરિક એટલે ઉર્મી એન્ડ ઇટ ઇઝ ધ લિરિક પોઈન્ટ ઇઝ મેજર વર્ડ્સ ડિયર ફ્રેન્ડ વી કેન યુઝ ઓલ્સો ધ અધર વર્ડ્સ એન ઓ ટી એ ડી એ નોટેબલ નોટ પાટ મેજર નોટેબલ ઓન ધી કેમ ઓલ્સો ટાઈપ ડાઉન ઓન ધ ફેમસ એફ એમ ઇંગ્લિશ ધીસ આર ધ સિમિલર વર્ડ્સ ગ્રેજ્યુઅલી વી હેવ ટુ ઇન્ક્રીઝ અવર વોક્યુબલરી પાવર ધીરે ધીરે આપણે નવા નવા શબ્દો શીખવાના ઓકે ફ્રેન્ડ્સ ઇન્ડિયા ઇઝ ધીઝ મેજર વર્ક્સ મેજર એટલે મુખ્ય ઓર મેન વર્ક્સ ધીઝ નોટેબલ વર્ક્સ ઓર ધીઝ ફેમસ વર્ક તો દેર વોઝ અ કલેક્શન ઓફ ધ પોઈન્ટ્સ 